Hey Miranda, I got your Sahara right here. Your Wrangler. It's looking really good. I just took it through the wash. You got your leather interior. Sahara seats. The white stitching in there. So the leather spill on it, you can just wipe it up real nice. Got your shifter, your emergency brake, and your nav unit. I'll show you that in a little bit. Here's the back seat. So just run through quick and then I'll get into more detail. I just want you to see everything. There's the hard top with the color matched on the top. To take down these rear seats, there's just a handle right here. You just pull on that, pull forward. And as the seat hits the seat in front of it, it hinges and moves that headrest out of the way. And then you've got clear access to the back. Um, it's the same on the other side for the larger section. To get into the back, you've got your full size spare right there. You just pull on this handle, open it up. It'll lock at the very end, so it'll stay there if it's windy. The thing I really like about what they did with these new Wranglers is if you can see here, that's the rear defrost. So your rear wiper won't actually get stuck to your window. You won't have to worry about wrecking your wiper because it'll heat it up and get it unstuck for you. Um, there's lots of room in the back here. Like you said, for your, your uh, stroller, for your little one. Just close that up. Got your full-size spare on the back, which is really nice. 20 inch, 20 inch rims. There's the view from the the passenger side. Just move these papers out of the way. You got the seats. I'm trying to go kind of slow for you here. You can see everything. I'll show you the engine compartment, show you where you check the oil and your coolant and your washer fluid. So right there you got your washer fluid, they're all labeled, your engine coolant, and then over here you got your dipstick for your oil to check that. Um, your battery is there in the back corner. You got your V6 engine. Now we'll go inside and I'll show you a little bit on the on the screen. So right here we've got your it's on the radio. Um, so you can push here and select between the different. Or you can just click satellite radio. Personally I like 79. Radio Disney. Um, you got your media. So there's a there's a hard drive in here. A 40 gig hard drive, so you can load it full of like whatever you want music, movies, photos. Um, you can't really watch the movies while you're driving, but if you're camping and you decide you want to just watch a video, you can. So here's the navigation on every screen, it'll have Navi up in the corner, so you can at any time you can just click on that. Um, this button little back button and you can type in the destination you want detours tools so if you need like well where am I and if you need police station fuel hospitals it's all right there um, got a calculator too I didn't even know until now that they had that um, yeah so on off button right here your volume control sorry it's hard to video and to talk at the same time uh, USB right here and your auxiliary so if you want to charge your phone you got it right there and then plug that in there all your window controls are in the middle because you can take the doors off on these Wranglers um, so here's the front and the rear windows you got your AC your fan um, push for AC push for rear defrost so you can activate that on the wiper in the back your heated seats in your, in your front 
and then the outlet um, that's located just below and under here. Um, I wouldn't recommend trying to run a microwave or anything off that, but you got your mirror controls right here. Your volume controls when you're driving are on the back, same with on the other side, but you have same within your Grand Cherokee. Glove compartment. Yeah, those are the basics. You can move your seat just with that lever right there. Adjust the height and then the angle of the backrest. So yeah, that's your Wrangler. If you have any questions, just give me a call. Thanks, Miranda.